Welcome to Pins and Things. Today I'm going to show you guys how to make these shamrock chocolate covered strawberries for St. Patrick's Day. So first we've got four strawberries that are all around the same size. We've got some green melting chocolate and three. So this is our three leaf clover and this is our four leaf clover. And these are all about the same size too. I've washed them and dried them and they're ready to go. You're gonna wanna do these on a sheet of wax paper and probably on a plate or something that you can stick in the fridge or something that's movable after you've already put your shamrock together. So here's my wax paper and I'm putting it over the top of my turntable here. Now it's time to melt our chocolate. I'm gonna put it in the microwave for 15 seconds at a time until it's completely melted. Looks like it's about there. So the first thing I'm gonna do is dip it. And stick it down right where I want it to go. And then we're gonna dip our other two. I'm shaking off the extra and laying it down exactly where I want it to go. I want them to be touching because I want them to be connected when they cool. Plus, when you eat chocolate covered strawberries, do you eat just one or do you eat three? So I think that's perfect. I'm gonna take some of my green chocolate and put it into a baggie. And now I can cut the tip off of it and put special designs in. Now I actually have a picture here of a shamrock and I was thinking what I want to do is make these leaves separate so we can attach them on top of the three chocolate covered strawberries. So right now I'm going to be, I'm doing my best to recreate the shape and the designs on the leaves of the shamrock on just a sheet of wax paper. I'm also trying to get them similar to the actual size of the strawberries themselves so that they will fit on there really well. Okay, it looks like it's all hardened and ready to peel off and it peels off very nicely from the wax paper. So now we're just gonna put a little dab of chocolate on our strawberries and go ahead and attach all of the leaves onto our chocolate covered strawberries. So there's our shamrock. So we're going to be attaching our little tail that we've made. I'm just gonna dip it into the chocolate and hold it right at the bottom of our clover. So cute. It's done! Our chocolate covered strawberries, three leaf clover. Now we should make a four leaf clover. Plus, maybe I'm a maniac, but uh, I eat more than one chocolate covered strawberry every single time I make them, if you know what I mean. <laughs> I love chocolate covered strawberries. They're my favorite food in the entire world. Yeah. So this is the perfect excuse to say, nope, I don't, I get all four of these because it's, it's really just one treat. And look, this really is one piece, one treat. Because I can pull it all off at the same time. And underneath, you can see it's all melted together. So it's very sturdy. It's almost like a giant piece of cake, but chocolate covered strawberries, woo! Look at how beautiful this miraculous treat is. Four leaf clover! Look at all four of those kids over there ready to eat. I'm gonna chop it. You know what? These all are hearts because I love you guys. I hope you guys loved this video. Make sure to subscribe if you aren't already. Also, you can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram where I do stuff like this all the time. If you click over there, you can see St. Patrick's Day videos. And if you click over here, you can see me more every day on the Beach House where we do daily vlogs. We will see you guys next time.